Hi everyone, I welcome you to the presentation of this lecture on uh, water heater control circuit. Okay, so in this lecture, we're going to talk about the water heat, the electric water heat. It looks something like this. Others go with the geyser. So basically, this circuit is used to supply power to a water heater or a geyser, and it is able to control its operations. So the following should be noted when we are wiring a water heater control circuit. Number one, the cable size to be used depends on the size of the water heater as regard to the load. But the following are the recommended cable size. We've got the 2.5 square millimeters, 4 as well as the 6 square millimeters. The MCB rating to be used also is dependent upon the size of the load. So the following are the recommended ones. 15 amps, 20, 25, 30 or 45 wiring the water heater so when we're wiring the water heater of course we get supply from the distribution box which is the tv from there we run three cables live from the output of the circuit breaker and then the green from the earth bar the black from the neutral bar from there you give the water heater switch or the geyser switch this looks like that it's like a one gang one way switch but it has a lamp there behind it has those terminals just like a cooker control so it has three terminals let me just say two inputs and two outputs and there is a point where you connect the earthing so from the supplier from the gb you give the input and from the output there it goes to the load so this is the output you give your load which is the water heater or the geyser so this is a basic simple circuit for the water heat thank you